right welcome welcome viewers this is 433 uf capacitor we want to test some of the capacitors with a mount meter this is the column where we used to test uf and we use those two right let's switch on our mount meter we want to turn yes let's turn it to uf column right here it reads zero when there is nothing is being tested right our capacitor is reading 68 uf we are targeting 68 uf right there are many ways to check our capacitors right let's insert it in those two holes because it's on two uf so we have to increase we got we are we switched it to 20. it's not giving a reading right let's take it to 100. now it's giving us a reading 63 it's good so this capacitor is good right after we do this you can change to diode mode where you can test so first let's discharge it after you discharge it we then start testing it right if you listen carefully there is a beep sound on this capacitor yes it's giving a reading which means that the, the capacitor is good you try or you do it severally until you get the yeah, it's, it's good. It's good. Right. Let's switch to 2000K. We still want to check how it reads. You get that? You see that? Right? Right? You take your time to do these things. Right, we've selected to a bigger range. You see what is happening. You get that? Let's try 200. You see, here it starts by decreasing, now it's increasing. Right. That's how we test this uh, type of capacitors. Right, let's change and take another one. 
this one I want to show you something you see on top it's swollen right if you take a look on these two capacitors they are different which means this one uh, the small capacitor is damaged right so how do you test and find out if this is not working right we are going to test it when, we, when first we discharge it and we start testing it right it's giving us a reading telling us that this uh, capacitor is good yes sometimes but there is a reason why i removed it from the motherboard i will show you this right let's continue testing you see that it's reading good but it's not good Now, we are going to check its UF. UF is going to be low. Get that. Let me just, uh, yeah, you see, it's reading 38 instead of 1000 UF. That's where we say this capacitor is bad you see that 1000 uf we are not getting 1000 uf we are we, because of our mount meter it's not reading its scale it's not up to or more than uh, 1000 uf it ends on 200 it was supposed to give us zero o. look on that one you get it so that's how we check or we take a look we test all these uh, capacitors right Let's check this one. This one is 470, 25 volts. Yes, if you want to test it on the scale 450 UF, it will give us that sign, which means we need to upgrade our what? Our mount meter so that we can we are able to test different types of capacitors with bigger uf right anyway let's take this smaller one it's written 10 uf let's start read uh, take a reading on it and see how it reads right oh let me right you get that zero po uh, it's nine point seventeen it's a good capacitor 9.17 it's a good capacitor right this is how we do these things this is another capacitor we
we are still on 100 UF. Yeah, we start from smaller. Going up. This, it's reading 117. Let me, 118, yes. 118, which is good. 118, it's a good capacitor. Right, this is how you check all this. Guys, if this video is helpful, please like, like, comment, and subscribe for more tips. Thank you.